Have you ever been bombarded with terms like good carbs and bad carbs and forced to think that certain carbs are harmful no matter what? Let me tell you, this couldn't be further from the truth. In today's video, we're going to break down some of these myths and reveal six bad carbs that are actually good for you as part of a balanced diet. But before we dive in, make sure to subscribe to our channel because we post content that busts common food myths, helping you make informed choices about your diet. Let's get started. First up, let's talk about a global staple, white rice. Often villainized for being a refined carb, white rice is actually a treasure trove of nutrients. Contrary to popular belief, it's not just empty calories. White rice is low in fat and completely free of added sugars and sodium. It's a fantastic source of calcium, iron, and magnesium. And for those with celiac disease or gluten sensitivity, white rice is a safe and satisfying option. Enriched white rice goes even further, packed with additional micronutrients like folic acid. While it's true that it's lower in fiber due to processing, it doesn't deserve the bad rap it often gets. Moving on to a food that's a staple in many households. Bread. Oh, the variety of breads. But did you know that not all bread is created equal? Whole grain bread, for instance, is rich in fiber, while enriched white bread boasts a higher content of B vitamins. And then there's sourdough, a unique and ancient form of bread with surprising health benefits. Sourdough's magic lies in its fermentation process. Recent studies show that regular consumption of sourdough bread can positively impact your gut health and even help regulate blood sugar levels. But what about pasta? Many see it as a guilty pleasure. However, pasta is much more than just a comfort food. Pasta has a unique protein structure that slows down digestion, leading to a lower blood sugar spike compared to other refined carbs. This makes it a better choice for maintaining steady energy levels. Moreover, pasta generally has a low to medium glycemic index. And here's something interesting. A study found that postmenopausal women who included pasta in their diet had a reduced risk of stroke and heart disease. This aligns with other research suggesting that pasta eaters tend to have better overall diet quality, consuming more essential nutrients like folate, fiber, iron, and magnesium. Our next carb is a summer favorite, corn. Whether it's on the cob or in a salad, corn brings more to the table than just its sweet taste. Especially the yellow variety, corn is a natural source of lutein and zeaxanthin, crucial for eye health. It's also rich in fiber, protein, and other vital nutrients like zinc and magnesium. And if you're lucky enough to try purple corn, you're in for an added health bonus. Purple corn is packed with anthocyanin, a powerful antioxidant linked to reducing bad cholesterol and the risk of cognitive decline. Let's peel back the layers on another misunderstood carb, bananas. Often maligned on the internet and social media for their sugar content, bananas are actually nutritional powerhouses. One medium banana isn't just a quick snack, it's a bundle of energy with zero added sugars, only 100 calories, and three grams of fiber. Packed with essential nutrients like potassium, magnesium, and vitamin C, bananas are a boon for your health. The potassium in bananas is particularly noteworthy, supporting heart health and being a key component of the DASH diet, known for its effectiveness in maintaining healthy blood pressure levels. And if you prefer your bananas a bit green, you're getting the added benefit of resistant starch, a type of probiotic fiber that nurtures healthy gut bacteria. Last but not least, let's talk about potatoes. Often seen as a guilty pleasure, especially when fried or loaded with butter, potatoes in their natural form are incredibly nutritious. They're not just a source of carbohydrates. They provide fiber, vitamin C, and potassium. Recent research has even shown that potatoes can fit into a healthy diet for people with diabetes. A 2021 study revealed that adults with type 2 diabetes who included skinless potatoes in their evening meal had a lower overnight blood glucose response compared to those who ate basmati rice instead. This challenges the common belief that potatoes are off-limits for diabetics. It's important to remember that no food is inherently good or bad. What matters is the overall balance and variety in your diet. Carbs like white rice, bread, pasta, corn, bananas, and potatoes can offer significant health benefits and can be part of a balanced diet, particularly for those in good health. 
So next time you hear someone label these carbs as bad, remember the nutritional facts and enjoy them as part of your diverse and nutritious diet. If you found this information helpful, please give us a thumbs up and share the video with friends and family. Don't forget to subscribe for more myth busting and informative content. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.